In this example, I need to find the exact value of the sine of negative 5 pi over 4. As the problem states exact value, this means don't use your calculator as that will give you a decimal approximation. I need to use the unit circle shown over here. But looking at the angle of negative 5 pi over 4, is that angle anywhere on my unit circle? No, all the angles on the unit circle are positive, and I have a negative angle. Now there are two different ways to solve this problem. I'm going to show you both methods, and you can pick the one you prefer. The first method uses coterminal angles because trig functions of coterminal angles are equal. So I need to find an angle that's coterminal to negative 5 pi over 4 and is also somewhere here on my unit circle. Now how do we find coterminal angles? You take your given angle of negative 5 pi over 4, and you're either going to add or subtract some multiple of one revolution to it. Since my angle is in radians, one revolution is 2 pi. My given angle is negative, so I'm going to start by just adding one revolution to it. So I'm just going to add 2 pi. I have a fraction and 2 pi, so turn 2 pi into a fraction by dividing it by 1. I need a common denominator of 4. So multiply numerator and denominator by 4. So I get negative 5 pi over 4 plus 2 times 4 is 8 pi over 4. Negative 5 plus 8 is positive 3 pi over 4. Now is 3 pi over 4 on my unit circle? Yes, it is right over here. So the sine of negative 5 pi over 4 equals the sine of its coterminal angle of 3 pi over 4. And remember, on the unit circle, the x-coordinate is the cosine of this angle. The y-coordinate is the sine of this angle. I need the sine of that angle, so my answer is the square root of 2 divided by 2. So the sine of negative 5 pi over 4 is the positive square root of 2 over 2. Now in method 2, I'm going to use the fact that the sine function is an odd function. Remember, a function f is an odd function if f of negative x equals negative f of x for all x in the domain of f. So in this case, the sine of negative 5 pi divided by 4, using this definition here, is going to equal the negative sine of positive 5 pi over 4. Now, is 5 pi over 4 on the unit circle? Yes, it is right here. I need the sine of this angle, so that's the y-coordinate, which is negative the square root of 2 over 2. So my answer is going to be the opposite of this y-coordinate of negative the square root of 2 divided by 2. What's the opposite of a negative? It's a positive. So my answer is just the square root of 2 divided by 2. Now did I get the same answer by method 2 as I got in method 1? Yes. Now it doesn't matter which method you use, pick the method you prefer.